Hello, hello, and welcome to the show. Hello, folks. Today, we are going to build a mall. That we are. Uh, and we talked a little bit about this at the end of the last episode. And I know we said we were going to start this episode with an X-ray machine. Um, but we're having fun... Exploring the the mines and caves and whatnot down there. Are you shooting at me or is somebody else shooting at me? I was gonna shoot at you, but then I realized I'd like drawn the bow all the way back, and I didn't want to actually hurt you. <gasps> so I decided not to. That's awfully nice of you to not hurt me. Go. Oh, mushrooms! Is that the new iron? Ooh, mushrooms! No, I just uh, saw red and I was like, oh, what's that? And I realized it was mushrooms, so I said, ooh, mushrooms. Oh, diamonds. Ooh. Did I still touch on you? I do. Looks like just three. I'll take them, though. There, the oh, you missed a lapis. Did? Yeah. More Probably than one. In trouble. Multiples. What? What did I? What they? They were right here. In there was the only sky? one showing. Oh, okay. But. but wow. This goes up into some. Oh. Oh. <laughs> up into some creep. Don't fall backwards. Up into some. Oh. Uh, I'm gonna play that on replay. <laughs> Yeah, that would have sucked to fall on that. It looks cool, but man. Whee. Pretty. Pretty lights. Alright. We'll find some zombies. There's I'm plenty like, of creatures in here. Holy cow. It just opens up into this huge area. Whoa! Watch <laughs> out. There's mobs everywhere. Whoa! Jeez Louise, man. That guy went flying. <laughs> Where'd... Yeah, do you hear all them spiders? Is there another opening over there? Over there? Because I'm hearing um, multiple spiders. Like, yeah. If I didn't hear multiples, I wouldn't worry about it. Let me go look real quick. I was just uh, getting some coal is all I was doing. Hello. Oh, yep. Shot. Spider spawner. And go away. I'm looking at cobblestone that I did not place right now. Okay. Boom. Yep, could use some help. Holy cow, I think I'm gonna die. No, I Don't got die. this. I got this. I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kill you? Mm. <laughs> Spiders do like no damage. Oh, my helmet's gone. I've been taking some damage though. <laughs> Alright. That corner. That corner. That corner. And. Oh goody. Redstone? Uh iron? We got a bucket. We got a saddle. Yeah, bread. You got here. Do you did you pick up wheat as well? Nope, just bread. Alright. Let's leave that one there and I'm gonna put some junk in it. Junk, junk. Uh Junk, junk. Junk. And I suppose I'll put the bucket in there for now. And then I'm gonna take this one. So, did you write down the cords for this one? Uh, I'm not gonna use it. A spider spawner, I don't even want to deal with it. They don't even give you, they don't even give you that much XP or anything. But I mean, okay. I can, I can show my map. So we I can mean, show if, it. if it's close, I'm just thinking that, you know... Creeper behind you. If... 
it's gone now. So much for the spawn. <laughs> <laughs> well, that makes that decision easy. Wow. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Man. Did you get all of our mossy cobble? <laughs> that's what I'm working on right now. All right, that's cleared out. Um, for anybody at home that is trying to play on our map and you want to know where that spawner is, there you go. That's the cords for it. Ooh, that was really close, too, actually. That's a shame. Yeah. It was a spider spawner, though. Anyway, so spider spawner... I, I just meant... ...at basically those coordinates, give or take, and, uh... Yeah, we destroyed ours via a creeper. Well, we had help. <laughs> <laughs> I think we're just going to continue to do it that way and see if we can come across something else. And if at the time we're ready to uh, implement a, a mob tower, if you will, and we still haven't found a closer mob spawner, then we will go ahead and pop an x-ray machine in the ground at that point and see what we can find. But, uh, we've been both kind of sitting here dreaming and thinking about this, <laughs> this mall idea, and I think, I think we both just decided we should just do it. We should. So, that's what we we're going to be working we on any, today. We don't have any wood over here, do we? Um, there's some wood. We can chop down some trees. Uh, up here in the top. Um, okay. Oh yeah, there's a couple right. stacks. Okay, because I want some planks for flooring. Stacks on stacks. <laughs> so, we're going to implement a few things. This is going to be a three-story tall uh, mall. It's going to incorporate this entire block like we talked about before. And we're going to keep this center area that Rain likes so much. Uh, maybe make some kind of a waterfall or fountain feature in it as well. And um, I'm going to make, you know, basically little store sections in it, like a, like your standard typical strip mall or, or, um, help me out here, dude. Like, like a, suburb, a suburban mall, you know. Yeah, the small have, stuff, you know. not like, not like the JC Penney's and big department stores, but like the little the mall department stores. Uh, no, that's not what I meant. But you know what I mean. So, <laughs> uh, basically, the idea is to use this as our storage. So each store will be containing a specific kind of block or, or item. And that way it'll all be in one, one place, but in huge quantities. And uh, should allow us to store a lot Yeah, um, a lot of stuff and be organized with it. <laughs> Rain also wants to um, do some skylight in the center to mm -hmm. really make this center area pop. And I'm thinking about putting in some kind of uh, glass doors with like pressure plates or something to get into. So we'll start working on that. And we'll get with you guys as we're moving along on different things, different different parts that we're talking about and whatnot. We'll carry on and see what happens here. Looks like the sun's already going down. I tell you, these days aren't long enough. Nope. Oh man, I got a bunch of stuff on me. I gotta clear out my inventories. So you were thinking for the outside um, you want to do or throughout, you want to do sandstone accents? I kind of want to do like some, you know, stripey things and yeah, some sandstone and stripey just want things. Want to be kind of like there's usually stripes around the outside of a mall or like a stripe decoration, you know? Oh, I understand what you're saying. Okay. So that's what I'm thinking. Um, uh, so since I'm over here grabbing some lapis, uh, about to see what we got here. I was reminded very recently um, from 4J Studios on Twitter they are going to be releasing the next part of the updates for the Xbox version 
And uh, I think the best part about that came with the fact that we are going to be able to reset the nether. Yes, and that is a lovely thing. Isn't it? So a lovely thing indeed. I'm going to keep a stack of lapis over here. Um, so knowing that now, the whole concern about if we have a stronghold or not in the nether, it makes that a lot easier. <laughs> yeah, that was, I was really kind of bummed about not having one because it's not just the not having a stronghold, it's the fact that it means you can't do any enchanting. Because you don't have any blaze rods, and you have to have blaze rods to build an enchanting table. Or not an enchanting, a, a um, potion. potion stand. You were going to say yeah. alchemy, weren't you? No, I wasn't. That's why I didn't say that. Because <laughs> <laughs> that's what it is, is alchemy. No way. Well, another thing about that, too, is, you know, not like I'm necessarily going to be making a ethos-style blaze trap, mob, sp mob spawner trap, but it would be cool to, if you're in there, you know, smacking some blazes around for some XP or smacking them around for whatever. Those blaze rods work awesome for Furnace. Not that coal's hard to come by, but it's not. It's it's like a it's a it's a it's basically a wash. That's why there's other ways in the game to to smelt things and use them right. you know, use as as fuel in a furnace. Um I'm I'm a big uh, fan of the whole lava thing, but yet I don't want to go into the into into the Nether and see lava pools going every which way because you're just randomly taking lava out of the out of the lakes. That doesn't look very nice, you know. Picky. <laughs> Sun's going down again. It just keeps doing that, you know. I know, man. It's crazy. It's crazy. While you're working on that, want to take a look behind you and tell me what you think. Pretty. If you like that. I, I like those two colors together, personally. Yeah, they look good. You think that's a good uh, spa separation, spacing? I think so. Okay. I mean, and I don't think we need to do a colored stripe on every floor by any means. No. Dude, seriously, the sun's already going down again? I swear they made the the days go faster. <laughs> Possible, I suppose. Oh, that's the wrong block. Putting sandstone Probably shouldn't down. use that one, then. Yeah. Hello. Lady. Just saying is all. What? Just saying is all. <laughs> As you, m m many of you will know by now, I went ahead and made a Harlem Shake video. I got infected with it just like everybody else did. <laughs> infected is right, man. <laughs> you know, I I I've said this uh, on the video itself, and I've told many of people. A lot of people don't get where it came from and don't understand it. I'm not saying I do. I'm just saying it's cool and fun. Uh, but I can tell you this. The fact that it's made umpteen million people smile and, and or laugh. That right there in its own is, is worth its weight in gold. You know what I mean? Anytime Happiness is a good thing. Exactly. Anytime you can make the masses smile, just even smile. And and I haven't come across anybody who's like a nay, a nayer, naysayer. A lot of people will be like, they don't get it, they don't understand what it's all about. That doesn't mean that they don't, you know, enjoy it. Yeah, they're still okay, entertained. Okay, so. all right. <laughs> that's that's, you know. 
whoever whoever originally posted a Harlem Shake video can say that they created something that make made the world smile. So. Yep. That's certainly not nothing. And and well, you you took it. <laughs> took that that short and that stick. And and you took it. Uh, good old Jane. One of the great thinkers of our age. Yeah. Well, or a future age when Earth that was can no longer support our masses. <laughs> Jane, also known as the non-Baldwin Baldwin. Yes. For those that don't know. I'll never guess what I found. What'd you find? Ooh, iron. <laughs> Follows me everywhere, man. It's crazy. Ay ay ay. Uh we got a problem here. No, I made it even because I was planning on making multiple buildings. Huh. Made it like thirty, didn't I? I did. Um Yeah, that was wrong. You shouldn't have done that. It's all your fault. You broke it. Alright, babe. Looks like we're gonna have Three stores on the main... I mean three. Mm. I can count. Four stores on the main floor? Okay. What do you think? I mean, I could put another one in on this area here. But then mm -hmm. we're kind of impeding on the openness of the walkways and whatnot. Yeah. I kind of like the idea of having openness. I mean, maybe we could even put in some chairs and tables here, you know? Now I just got to figure out these stairs. Mm -hmm. Gee, you didn't get that from Biffa, did you? What? <laughs> uh, does he do as that? You're, as you're thinking of what to do all the time, yeah. Uh, well, I didn't intend to do it. Whatever. I'm thinking, totally oh, did. I'm going to be Biffa. Such a copier. Whatever. Such you're, you're, a copier. You're such a copier. It's not centered. Dang it all the heck. <laughs> Your fountain's not centered. I never said it was. Alright, well, I am out of sandstone, so this is as far as I'm going to get today with this. <laughs> uh, but we've gotten basically the first floor laid out. We're going to have four storefronts in the first floor. And we talked about putting seating areas on these sides, possibly like coffee stands and whatnot. And then we got stairs, which I found out this is not symmetrical because that's an odd number and that's an even number. But I think I made it work <laughs> to where it, it becomes even in the end and it doesn't look too terrible. And even if it does, it's her fault, not mine, because I didn't do it. So. Wow. I feel the love, let me tell you. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I, I think that looks good. I think it turned out pretty, 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 pretty okay. We'll uh, keep on yeah. working on it. Um, we got plenty of room here for my doors. I uh, decided to move them both to this end so we could utilize the space more effectively. I think three floors will be plenty of room once we get that all taken care of. We're going to have the center kind of opened up all the way to the top so that uh, Rain can make her glass top that she's wanted. And I think adding the blue lip lapis lazuli in there was a good idea. Um, I'm going to see if I can't Aww, figure out some man. other decoration things to do as well, because I, I would like to make this a little bit more busy than it is. Yeah, it's a little a little flat, but it's like, got to kind of walk that line between <laughs> making it way too busy and making it... Well, you don't want three, three uh, block thick walls just to get that depth, so... Right, yeah. Alright, um... What? Didn't even cover, so I will go ahead and show you guys. We I was working on roads. We decided to make a bridge over to that island there. Because we're from Alaska, so he's making a bridge to nowhere. Yep. Uh, <laughs> we th are planning on making an aquarium there. There's been a lot of uh, squid swimming around in this little thing it's pretty deep in certain areas 
So I think we're going to change this bridge off to the end of this straight out and then make some kind of a, a, an aquarium. And uh, we'll, we'll go into more on that as we get more done in this, in this uh, new cityscape. So we're going to be wrapping it around this section here and probably around that side, but we'll see how far we end up going. Uh, that's it for today. Don't forget that like and subscribe if you enjoy my videos. Anything you want to add to that, honey? No. I think that about covers it. I'm almost going to drown in a hole, but yeah. other than that, I'll go. <laughs> <laughs>